Друзья, рядом со мной находятся дизайнеры, которые работают с маркой Artcher. И я задам им также несколько вопросов. Guys, I saw a lot of new beautiful collections. Tell me please, uh, you are following trends or you are trying to create them? But sometimes we try to follow, sometimes we try to create some news, but <clears throat> you can do one without the other one usually. Uh, what we usually do is to not only create, to study, research, watching, touching, and catch some something from a field and try to put this catching to another field. So this is the only way to innovate, because if I'm still working all day long in sanitary wear, it is quite difficult to create something new. I need to, to go outside, take a look at you, your suite, I don't know, something like uh, just this material, a gray, and, And, anyway. also, and also look at things from a different point of view. Exactly. Because when you change the perspective, you can uh, think about something that nobody has thought about. It, you know? And I think this is our secret uh, in uh, innovation. In Don't science. tell him. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so keep it secret, please. Okay, okay. <laughs> tell me, uh, where you source the inspiration uh, to create those particular collections that presented here? Okay, so in here we are uh, presenting different uh, typology of products, you know, from a, a very classic collection, Civitas, for example, to a very modern and innovative collection like the one. Two opposites, somehow. You know? two, two opposites, so is uh, actually uh, there's no one only source of inspiration. The sources of inspiration are multiple, you can say. You know? And uh, for sure we look for Civitas in a more traditional way. We try to interpret the values of uh, the classic yes. ceramic uh, icons, uh, icons exactly. columns, all those kind of things. Mm. While in uh, the one uh, we try to make it something really new, different. The one represents a new step forward in the ceramic. Zone, I guess. Yes, a milestone in the ceramic uh, uh, sanitary wear. So we took the concept from the wash basin with thin edge and we tried to make it in the sanitary wear collection. And we could do that thanks to uh, uh, the rimless collection that is already used in the sanitary wear. One important thing is... Uh, this What about is the seat? The seat, exactly. Thank you, Marco. Thank you for the question. <laughs> We make uh, something very different uh, in the seat because we we call it hingeless without hinges. Ah. We took the hinges out of the seat because the hinges are always the more uh, delicate point in the sanitary wear because for the fixing, for the maintenance, mm -hmm. for the cleaning, you know, and also they re hygienic. They represent a very thick element in the in the seat cover, you know. And through this uh, sandwich of material, we create a different way to open the, the seat. So we have two different layers. On the bottom we have a solid surface. Solid surface, okay. such a Korean, and the upper part, uh, the wood. So a lot of innovation. A lot of innovation. Yeah, in this case, yes. You know, sometimes we, uh, people speak about innovation. I innovated, we too, we too. But <laughs> in this time, we, we really did it. So we are quite proud about that because it is something uh, really new for this field, for this market. So, yeah. Very good. Yeah. Congratulations, guys. Uh, really much. interesting and really, truly innovative collection. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you.